Hey, what's up, everybody? It's your boy, Boo Boy Kennels. This is uh, just a little quick update on uh, a build that I'll be working on uh, throughout this summertime because it probably won't be done until the summertime. Anyway, as most know, you know, my old system had the uh, Crosshair 4 formula with the, uh, the uh, AMD 1100T and also the uh, Mushkin Red Line, which I still have a brand new pack of the uh, Kingston HyperX uh, 8 gig kit. Not sure what I'm going to do with it. I may keep it, may sell it, may give it away. Really don't know yet. But, anyways, I'm going to be taking my old system and I'll be putting it into this new case here, which is the. Uh, the uh, Corsair 500R. I was uh, looking, actually looking for a uh, like mini tower, you know, small tower. Then I just decided to go with the mid tower instead. I did look at a few cases. Um, as far as mid towers were concerned, uh, like one of the uh, Shinobi cases. Um, the uh, was it the half. Half X922 because I really do like their design. Also, the uh, 400R from Corsair, which actually would have been a lot cheaper than uh, getting this one here. But I did like the few extra features that it does have. And you know, being a mid case, mid tower, you know, it doesn't really have to be spectacular, but you know, we'll, we'll see how it goes as far as uh, the whole airflow. Thing, thingamajigger is concerned and I haven't really decided what I'm going to use it for whether this is going to end up being like a uh, for my home server use and the reason I say that is because I'm waiting to see what the uh, new uh, 680s end up looking like price wise if it's something within within my budget then I'll take out the uh, 269 70s out my current rig and then I put it back uh, to this setup, which is where it originally was at before I upgraded my uh, my gaming system. And then I just stick it in this rig because I know the uh, I know the cards that fit in there. I know that for sure. Plus, the other reason I got ended up going with this case in a, instead of a, a much smaller case is because I know the uh, Noxual NHD 14 fits in it. And that was really one of my main things. I, I want to be able to still use the Noxua cooler. So I'm ordering another cooler for this one. I've already ordered another uh, CD DVD burner. And some extra uh, SATA 3, SATA 2 cables that I'm going to need to use. But anyway, it's going to be the, uh, the latest system I'll be using. I don't know how good the light is in here. The light kind of sucks ass, but... Yeah, uh, it ain't going to be too good to look at, but anyways, I think that's just kind of how it all look old. And uh, oh, and the other thing that I wanted to keep as well that some of the other uh, assist, uh, cases didn't have was um, it does have the USB 3.0, which is what I wanted, and because my Crosshair 4 formula board has firewire this case also supports firewire so I can be able to connect it you know from the uh, front header to my motherboard itself which does have it which is one thing I, I didn't like about the uh, Rampage 4 Extreme it didn't have a firewire header I mean I understand why it didn't but you know I still use firewire devices and that was something that to me was important but anyways you know like I said that's what I'll be uh, sticking together uh, hopefully by the end of the summer I have it done and like I said more than likely it may end up being a home server or it may just be a secondary rig you know who knows because one of the other things I'm planning on doing and and it all depends on how the A10 uh, uh, AMD APUs turn out to be or I may just go with the A8 is I definitely want to make a small HTPC system and I'm kind of leaning towards the uh, what's it called? In in win, 
in in something. I think it's in win. I know it's called Dragon Slayer. It's it's a real small case, about uh, sixteen inches tall. So I'm kind of going lean towards that route. That's something I want to do as well. But again, this is all something that uh, it'll it'll all be hopefully completed by the uh, the end of this summer, so I can get my shit on. Anyways, thanks for watching, and uh, till then, you know, peace out.